my coach, on a senior night, you got, your boys come through for you. Big win over Central Arkansas today in Lakefront Arena. Yeah, that, I mean, that's an extremely talented offensive group. Um, they got three dudes that can really score the ball. And I was proud of our group defensively, how they came in, what they're focused. So proud of our seniors. What an incredible um, contribution they've made over their four years. And what a just absolute uh, blessing they've been to coach. We're so lucky to have them and their investment, not only in our program as, as athletes, but on our campus as students in our community of, of how many hours they've given back over the four years, uh, giving back into our community and, and trying to build uh, not only a program, but help move our, our city forward. I mean, it's talking about the way your team played today. Yeah. A bunch of three-pointers, most since 2008, I believe it was. Yeah, it's crazy. I, you know, we I don't know that we've made that many three-pointers in, uh, in a week full of practices. Uh, we, we shot the ball like we haven't shot it before. And they were in rhythm. Most of them were good shots. Uh, none of them I felt were forced, uh, even a couple that would have been borderline. Uh, they still, when we'll look at it on the film, they're probably pretty good shots. The guys were squared up. They weren't forcing them. Uh, and Chris Davis got back in a rhythm and hit some late clock threes and some deep ones uh, that helped get us going. Uh, but for the most part, I really felt offensively uh, we gave up good for great a lot. I thought that you know we continued to, to try to, to make the extra pass and get our, our teammate a better shot than we had. And then we pounded the ball inside again and were able to get uh, great stuff against a tough zone to deal with uh, over the course of the night. Your team's had some games similar to this and they had a nice lead. If things happen down the stretch where it becomes a tighter game, yeah. today not the case. No, they're growing up. They're growing up. They're learning how to finish games. They're learning how to play uh, a lot tougher as a team and learning how to close things out. Um, and they're just they're maturing. They're getting better and developing. So I'm really proud of that. And uh, you know, I was we wanted to win the first four minutes. We wanted to win the first four, and just take it four minutes at a time. And and I thought our guys did that. They stayed focused. And you know, we'll carry that same approach. The next important uh, minute is the you know our, our practice coming up, and then we'll move to, uh, through that drill and get to the next drill, and just keep trying to plug away a little bit and get better. Big game coming on Thursday here in Lake Fun Arena against four-time defending conference champion Steve Nafoski. Yeah, they, I mean, they really they, they played at a high level against us over there. We didn't play well. All the, all the credit goes to them. They did a great job uh, of taking us out of some stuff that we wanted to do. It's going to be a tough, tough battle. Uh, we know that they're extremely well coached. Uh, they've got a winning pedigree over the last um, you know, four or five year stretch where they've been very, very good uh, in our league. And uh, it's a tough, tough ball club, but a very, very good program that's well coached, and they do a lot of good things. All right, Chris, appreciate it. Congratulations once again. Thank you a lot.